guys, I'm gonna do this really quick because it's dinner time and we're starving. Um, so it's Friday night and I stopped by Kroger to get these items because I had certain coupons and they had certain sales going on. Then I'm going to Walmart tomorrow to pick up the other half of my grocery order. Um, this came out to be, I believe, $92, but 30 of it was like miscellaneous items. So I got a pound of turkey from the deli, some mozzarella twisted breadsticks, some garlic three cheese, Texas toast, which I got last week too and had a miss out on, and I guess I'll miss out on it again this week since I'm still in this stinking diet. Uh, this is what I'll be eating tonight again, the Atkins Stone Fired Three Meat three meat pizza stone fire did i say that right anyway um this is freaking delicious but it's really small but you know you gotta do what you gotta do then i got some tgi friday's boneless chicken wings the honey barbecue um i'm also going to get two boxes you'll see in the next clip from walmart tomorrow for the ones with the bone in them but they had these um on sale at kroger and then i got this uh combo of chocolate and vanilla ice cream you know, I made the mistake of going there starving, and you know, I haven't had anything like ice cream or anything super fattening since I've been on this diet, even before my diet. It had been a while since I got ice cream, and I saw these, and I said, yes, they're not super low in calories or carbs, but way better than if I splurged and got like an ice cream cone or, you know, bought a big tub of ice cream and fixed a big bowl. So I figured just every blue moon, I will treat myself to a tiny little thing of that. And then I got some strawberries, a thing of raspberries, and a thing of blackberries. I got some community coffee. I had a coupon for that. I got four things of yogurt. Um, I got some more of that hummus. It was really, really delicious. Me and Andre ate on that last week. Then the free item at Kroger this week is Annie's shells and real age cheddar or any of her mac and cheese. So I got that one. And then my 90 calorie fiber one brownies. I got a huge thing of variety pack of chips because they were a little bit on sale. And then I got um, three half gallons of milk because they were a little bit cheaper this week. And the miscellaneous items, uh, all the boys in the house like this Old Spice Swagger bar soap, so I got a big thing of that. Uh, some aluminum foil, paper plates, which you can see we've already ripped open. Uh, some more toothpaste. Uh, this is the Neutrogena Fresh Foaming Hand, I mean Face Wash um, that I use. And then I had to get some more dish detergent, some oil for the truck, and some cat food. So that is everything that I got from Kroger. And in the next clip, you'll see what I am getting from Walmart. Okay, guys, so this came from Walmart. It is Saturday, so this is the next day. And I believe this came out to be $116. I only had one substitution, um, and it was for these wraps that I've been buying. It's the same brand, but they were out of the original wraps. This one may actually be better. I've never even seen this one before, but it says protein up, carb down. And it has 12 grams of protein in it, and then only 8 grams of net carbs. That's awesome. So as long as these taste just as good as my other ones, then I'm going to start getting these. I've never even seen these before. I would have been buying those. So I got those. And then um, this was just to come in a box, but I guess they were out of that brand that I ordered. Um, and they didn't consider this a substitution, but it's fine. It's just the same exact thing that I ordered, just a different brand. So they just gave me eight singles of those. And then I got some of those cupcakes. So those are snacks for the kids and Dennis. And then I got a carton of eggs some hot dog buns and then I got a pack of these bun length hot dogs and then some of these beef smoked sausage normally I do not buy hot dogs it is a rare occasion when I buy hot dogs um, because we just typically don't buy a lot of things made with like pork and red meat and everything but we haven't had these in forever and on this diet that I'm on I can eat these without the bun and I know Andre loves these smoked sausages so I figured we'd eat these as a treat and then I know I say I don't buy pork and stuff. I have been buying this fully cooked bacon. And I just, they're like super, super thin slices. And I put like two on my breakfast wraps in the morning. Um, so I really should probably try the turkey bacon, uh, the fully cooked turkey bacon on the wraps. But they haven't had any um, at Walmart lately. So I've just been getting that. And then I got a pound of ground turkey, uh, protein bars. And then I got this to try this week. It's the Atkins snack called Caramel Chocolate Nut Roll. Seven grams of protein and only three grams of net carbs. I so that, thought that would make a really good snack when I'm getting hungry. We'll try those. And then five boxes of frozen vegetables. I got a couple broccoli and cheese sauce and a couple of um, Brussels sprouts. I eat those at lunch. And then one night this week for the, um, the rest of the family, I'm making some cheesy ranch burger 
hamburger helper. And um, yeah, usually when I cook, I do try it one teeny tiny bite just to make sure it's seasoned right and tastes good for them. So I'm gonna have one teeny tiny bite of that just to see what it tastes like because I've never had that kind before. And then I got uh, some of those for Andre's breakfast this week. And then I got some more um, cheese sticks. I've been liking those for low carb. And then I got some shredded sharp cheddar cheese. And of course, my dog always has to go out when I do a grocery haul. I don't know why it is. <laughs> okay, and then um, for this week, um, I got another one of these chicken and broccoli Alfredo meals. If y'all are interested in Atkins meals, this is one of the best tasting ones. I thought it looked gross and it didn't smell that appealing. But oh my gosh, it is so well seasoned and so delicious. So I got another one of those for this week. And then I'm going to be trying this Italian style pasta bake the night that the family eats spaghetti. And then I have this one to try called Beef Merlot. And this had really good reviews on the Atkins site. So I thought I would try that one. And then for the family, I got chicken Alfredo to make one night. Uh, my favorite ragu sauce. Um, we needed more coffee creamer. And then I know y'all saw in the other clip about the chicken wings. So these are the two boxes of the honey barbecue chicken wings with the bone in them. Um, we are going to be eating those tonight. I usually go a little bit over my carbs on um, Saturday night. Uh, not my leg, just a ton, but a little bit. I don't eat like a ton of these though, but I love these. So it's kind of an extra special treat for me. And then I got two cans of sweet peas. I got a can of chili for the hot dog night. And then we're going to have tuna. I'm going to have tuna wrap for myself. They're going to have tuna sandwiches one night. And I usually get five or six cans of these. And somehow I only ordered two. So now I feel stupid. So I've got to get uh, a few more cans of those later on in the week. And then some spaghetti noodles. I got two of these. Andre likes these with the shrimp in them. Pop-Tarts, two boxes of soda, and some Hugs juice. And I think that is everything. So if y'all have any questions or comments, leave those down below. And as always, I will leave the link to the Walmart grocery pickup. If y'all want to go uh, place your order with them, you can click that link and it'll save you $10 off of your first grocery order. And thanks so much for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you guys next week for the next one. Bye.